Welcome to my channel and welcome to your weekly reading. So without any further ado, I'm going to start your collective uh, spiritual tarot reading with um, animal, spiritual animal deck. And uh, let's have a look. What is the card that summarizes overall energy for you? So we have sharp, interesting. My dear Cancer, there, I feel there is competition. This is the word I am hearing. Um, shark is quite um, an interesting, I would say, creature because if it's not provoked, it's just around, you know, it doesn't really give um, a threat as such. However, there is always a fear with this animal. It's always, you have to tip toe right so it's like maybe you're dealing with certain individuals uh, or individual particularly that you have to be very kind of um thinking what you're going to say how you're going to approach your body language you don't want really to cause an upset uh, or argument let's see what is the reason for this um and how can you work with this energy in your in your favor okay let's pull some clarifiers uh, let's start with the tarot weight uh, traditional deck interesting so i'm just gonna have a zip of my uh, coffee it's still early morning here we have temperance, we have a nine of pentacles, four of wands, and the chariot. It's actually a very nice clarifiers, I would say. Um, so I think, you know, this shark energy could be also um, yourself being uh, very emotional very quickly um, you can spark your your energy into into something you know that maybe you don't want really to show for people yeah so we all have our deep sort of emotional state or phase that we don't want you know to show to to people so it's about harmonizing this energy why i say this because when i saw the clarifiers i feel the um, temperance it's all about the harmony create a balance in your life create um peace inside you if your mind being very active very screaming in terms you know that you can't relax you can't switch off it's been too much you know thinking maybe about the money maybe about the home and you see these these clarifies this is you sort of you know one seat riding two horses if you've been thinking you know about money or about work um you know situation or about home so here's the money there is the wealth, the wealthy woman, and here is the happy home place. And you here with um, this chariot, and this is your card, uh, Cancer, trying, you know, to really ride this chariot with, um, you know, you, it's impossible to be in two places to do two things at the same time. So that's why the temperance is really asking, you know, to pace yourself, you know, to balance if you need the rest, if you need the peace, then get that peace for yourself, get that rest, right? Because even if you feel frustrated, even if you feel very sharky energy, even if you feel that, you know, people that are around you are quite um, provocative, um, not giving what you want because you cannot navigate through home, work, money situations, um, this is your perception. You know, so it's it's about balancing act, finding, you know, that inner peace that you can, first of all, project to others that you are peaceful, happy, you can manage many things, but also it gives you a confidence, you know, knowing that everything going to be fine. I will manage, you know, to resolve home 
money work situations um it's all about this bringing peace and harmony into your life i pull a couple other clarifiers so we have a page of pentacles that clarifies temperance we have king of pentacles that clarifies four of wands we have the magician that clarifies nine of pentacles and we have the hierophant that clarifies chariot so like i say all is really perfect you don't need really nothing to do apart from taking that step back and reflect and rest and get your energy levels harmonized why i say this because when you will do this act suddenly the money starts appearing right so we we get the page of uh, pentacles clarifying the temperance it's like maybe you need to go um into the nature spend the time maybe with with family um do something earthy yeah maybe a long walk with your family member with a friend someone there that you you hold and you will see that this king of pentacles appears and it really appears when you are at your happiest um, it seems that this king of pentacles will be in a position in authority to offer for you this pentacle this job that you want um this you know desired amount of money that you need um, and that clarifies the four of wands, which is the happy home place. So when you are at your happiest at your home, surrounded by, by your family members, by your kids, by your friends, you get, you know, this news coming from this authority person. And then if you felt this balance on your wealth, this balance on your coin, the magician appears and the magician really is you who stepped into this harmony, peace, rest, you attracting the wealth. You not necessarily need even to get, you know, some sort of um, a news about the money. It seems that you magically feel much better once you have that inner peace balance into your spiritual um, home into your physical body if you have rested it seems that you will wake up in the morning with completely different energy you feel love you feel harmony you feel abundant all right so this is the abundance card in magician it's all about that magic that you will trigger you will do it once you are relaxed once your mind is not jumpy and doesn't really triggers you to become this shark yeah and chariot has been clarified with um hair fun so major arcanas first of all so it means the hair fun really speaks about find it through wars spiritual wars and speak with yourself believe yourself you don't need to juggle one step at a time hair fun really is talking about get that you know big breath in your lungs and relax you know exhale with the peace exhale with this confidence comfort because only you can manifest you know the happiness the joy um i feel the word don't sabotage your life because of your frustrations not everything is lost there is plenty to gain if you will take one step back and start seeing your life as from a third person sort of view, you know, the stranger, the outsider, and seeing how much you have, but you need to balance yourself. So I feel that some of you cancers are just not giving yourself that, that peace that you need, right? So let's pull the final um, clarifiers for you in terms of the spirit advice and let's see how we're going to finalize this reading so we get the queen of wands and we get two of wands so there is definitely news coming news coming you've been waiting you've been contemplating and hoping and wishing you know that 
another doors would open, opportunities would come. And this is coming. You will get someone very unusual, very eccentric. I feel that you will hear from a woman um, who has, you know, a lot of passion. It could be an agent, um, a third party that actually acts on behalf of this king. Uh, this king is the decision maker. But funny enough that this lady who has a lot of passion and might be a fire sign uh, comes as a third party as an agent to give you the news about you know this opener this opportunity the window that opens you know all the possibilities for you that you were craving so this is beautiful reading for you my dear cancer i hope you enjoyed this reading please like share subscribe leave your comments how it resonates i really would like to hear and um, if you want a private reading, please get in touch. There is all details in about me uh, section. And I'll see you next week. Take care. Bye bye.